Welcome to my hotel. This is a game about running a hotel in the 1950s. October 1931, Chicago, my uncle, William Griffin, the owner of the Griffin Royal Hotel, was murdered in his own hotel. One of the guests found him dead at the bar. He had been shot in the front of his head. The case was suspicious from the beginning, but the police had no interest in solving it. The investigation was quickly closed. The reason for my uncle's death? An accidental shooting. Someone was very eager to keep the truth from coming out. The best hotel in the city was shut down and forgotten. Twenty years after William Griffin's death, I, Thomas Griffin, have returned to Chicago. I want to solve the mystery of my uncle's death and restore the former glory of the Griffin Royal Hotel. Now it's my hotel. Quite the accident of getting shot in the face, huh? However, I need to start from the very beginning, step by step. I'll start by cleaning the rooms. So this is my hotel. Um, once you use the room, enter inside. See how we mark. I did play a little bit of this um, a little while ago. I couldn't really see the screen very well because I was outside. I'm inside where it's nice and dark so I can see the screen a lot better. I still want to see if there's any option to turn the brightness up just a hair. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it doesn't seem like there is, and my laptop screen is all the way bright, isn't it? Yep. It is, okay. Give me a little more field of view, maybe. Yeah, like that. I did turn the audio off. Oh, uh, let's see. Uh... Welcome to my hotel. This is a game set in the 1950s. Uh, you're inheriting your... October 1931. Chicago. My uncle, William Griffin. The owner of the Griffin Royal Hotel was murdered in his own hotel. One of the guests found him dead at the bar. He had been shot in the front of his head. The case was suspicious from the beginning, but the police had no interest in solving it. The investigation was quickly closed. The reason for my uncle's death? An accidental shooting. Someone was very eager to keep the truth from coming out. The best hotel in the city was shut down and forgotten. Twenty years after William Griffin's death, I, Thomas Griffin, have returned to Chicago. I want to solve the mystery of my uncle's death and restore the former glory of the Griffin Royal Hotel. Now it's my hotel. Says? I need to start from the very beginning, step by step. I'll start by cleaning the rooms. So you have to repair the rooms, upgrade them, um, and you have to actually have to try to uncover the mystery in the simulation of what happened to your uncle. Uh, find out who, tried, who murdered him. You have to actually balance the factions and try and find out from the factions which who murdered your, father, your uncle. Uh, the four factions are the police, which are corrupt as hell, the mafia, the Russian mob, and basically the, um, the red light district. Let's put it that way. And as you can see, this hotel is really wonderful. Um, got Mickey Mouse running around here. See if we can maybe catch him. Yeah, this place is full of them, so. We'll see if we have any luck. Now this game does not make you like sit around waiting a long time. It actually has a time skip function, so which is rather nice. F to open. So this is the first room. A proper shape. Saying goodbye to the damaged furnishings, dingy walls, and ruined floor. 
Take an old piece of furniture and pack it up. Eat a pack. Grab the mop. Scrubber, scrubber, scrubber. Scrubber, scrubber, scrubber. Now you have a very limited amount of furniture to start with, so. I didn't get to the point where I can actually buy furniture yet, so. It's going very well. It's time to choose the right furniture. The most important thing is the bed. That's all I need to rent out the room. If I want the room to be more expensive and luxurious, I can add more furniture, decorations, and upgrade the bathroom. So, all you need, need to think this through carefully. Furniture needs space to be useful. Shut up. See. So we have two beds available to us right now. We'll put this one in here. So you have to make sure the entrance to the bed is actually open too. So when both boxes turn green, that means you can place it. Okay, let's As close as possible. There. Looks good. Now I can go to the board in the hall. On it, I can see all the rooms, what furniture is in each room. And thanks to the board, I can upgrade the bathrooms. So we're going to add a little more to this room because, well, we want to make a little more money than the basic, don't we? And we got a little record player here. Right by the door. Okay, so we got a little room. Now this bathroom is absolutely dire. If you look, this place is a nightmare. Look at that toilet seat. Ugh. Catch something nasty from this place. Okay, so what we do is go out in the hallway. Ah, caught Mickey. From the trash chute. Excellent. Oh, now we have to go to here. So right now we're getting 30 bucks a night for this hotel room. Upgrade it for $100. Now we're getting $55 a night. Let's upgrade the hallway too. Time to clean the lobby, the heart of the hotel. There's a board near the elevator that I can use to renovate the lobby. Now if we go back in here and look. The bathroom is much nicer now. Doesn't look like a um travesty. I do like the art style. It looks kind of like a 2D cell shaded almost. Go back down to the first floor. Now the lobby panel is right here. Upgrade, $100. How much is the next second upgrade? Thousand dollars. No, we're not gonna do that. Okay. Great. When I earn more money, I'll be able to make further improvements. Look how much nicer this looks already. Better and more comfortable furniture, more decorations. All of this will add more and more prestige to the hotel. Ah, those damn rats. There are traps upstairs. I need to go get them. Rats aren't that easy to get rid of. I'll have to keep dealing with catching these damn pests from time to time. The hotel bell. The first guest. I need to quickly go to the reception and use the guest book. Hello, sir. Now I have to choose the right room for this guest. I have a list of all the rooms here. Room yep. 101 will be perfect. I just finished renovating it. 
Now I just need to write the guest's name next to the room number, and it's done. So this is Thomas Anderson. You know the Matrix? That's uh, Neo's name, I believe, isn't it? I know Mr. Anderson, at least. So we drag him here, put him in the room. He pays us $55. Success. The first guest in 21 years. The Griffin Royal Hotel is slowly coming back to life. It's been a long day. I'll go to the clock and see what time it is. I'm glad this clock wasn't destroyed. It remembers the best years of this hotel. My uncle used to say that when he looked at the clock, time seemed to pass faster. Now I can use this clock and take a bit of a rest. So this is the time skip method right here. This clock. So instead of having to like sit around waiting for the ch guests to check out or whatever like that, you can just go up to here, hit F, and no events happening until 8 o'clock tomorrow morning, so 8 o'clock in the morning. First guest has left the hotel room. Time to do the laundry. Select the laundry. Go up here. Any more Mickey's? Nope, okay. So we open the room up and they leave the laundry right on the floor for us. I need to take this bag of dirty laundry and throw it down the chute. Yep. Pretty much all you do is put in the chute and you're good. Go. Now I have to go downstairs to the laundry room and start the washing machine. Let's make sure there's no other trash in here. Real quick. Any trash goes down the chute, basically. Laundry trash, dead rats, down the chute. Now... I'll take one of these with us too. It will go down to floor one. One's the lobby, two is the first floor. We'll see if we get any rats over here. The laundry's over here. You don't have to load the machine or anything, you just automatically put it in the machine and after the suck laundry machine. Boom. Great. I need to remember to collect the dirty linen bag after each guest. I should also do the laundry from time to time. Otherwise, guests will pay less. Okay, so it tells me at noon my next guest is coming in. Now, let's see here. Let's see. Craft finding rooms. Does it tell you anything about how to buy more furniture? Rats in the lobby disappear after the first floor upgrade. Okay. Okay, so the rest of the lobby are gone. Okay. Raz running out of hotel room and kill with a broom. Okay. Guess. Lock. Laundry. Repairs and bathrooms. Wes, the bar, bar menus, okay, nothing. Oh, it's almost that time, okay, back. So the next person is coming in very shortly. <clears throat> Hello, sir. How you doing? Okay. Put you right up here in the room. Boom. 
Oh, I got $660. So let's go up and start working on the second room. Oh, he's getting the elevator first. Okay. Slowpoke. There's also an upstairs up here as well. Yeah, I really like the style of this game. I hope it does well enough that I keep on playing on the channel too. Okay, elevator's back. Okay. Let's go up to floor two. No dead rats. Let's run down here. Last time I played, I saw some running around down here, too. So. Look at that right there. So the next room is, this one says occupied. This one's a bit bigger. So let's go ahead and uh, get the broom out real quick. Scrubber, scrubber, scrubber. Scrubber, scrubber, scrubber. Okay, it says optional repair the plumbing. From here in the plumbing. Aha. So this is a mini game. A D. And if you do that, you get an extra bit of money for doing that. Okay. So we go back into the furniture. We have one extra bed. We'll put this like right over here by the door. Come on, get in there. There we go. Uh, every tables, no. We have a music thing. That right here. We have a chair. You have two chairs. Ooh, two chairs. Put you here. Two chairs next to each other. And we have a wardrobe. I think we have a sofa too, don't we? No, not there. Don't have a desk. No, okay. Let's go ahead and upgrade the bathroom for this room as well. And we'll get down to that desk, the guest. Upgrade the room, upgrade. Close. Yes, I hear you. On my way. Yes, miss. So we can sell, put this room for $55. We have nothing going on right now. So just wait till in the morning. Dong, dong. Okay. Do we have to talk to the policeman? Hello, sir. How are you doing today? Welcome to my
my hotel. How can I help you? Good morning. I'm Inspector Wunuk from the local police. So it's true that the Griffin Royal Hotel is accepting guests again. We miss this place. Now that it's operational, I'll need your help. You'll be doing a service for the Chicago police, son. Your uncle would be proud. One does not refuse the police. What is it about, Inspector? A man of Italian descent will be coming to your hotel. Check him into room 101. And before you check him in, place this suitcase in the room. The contents of the suitcase are none of your concern. It's a matter between me and my Italian friend. Doesn't sound shady at all. Place the suitcase discreetly. It's very important. We don't want the wrong people finding out about this. I understand, Inspector. Are there any other details? How will I recognize the mentioned Italian? You'll easily recognize him by his Italian accent and hat. When the man leaves the room, go back for the suitcase and bring it to me. I'll be waiting at the bar. And don't worry, if you do everything right, you'll benefit more than you think. In this city, it's good to have the favor of the police. Understood, Inspector. Please enjoy our bar. I recommend the whiskey. Now I'll get back to my hotel duties. So you take this. Let me run over to the hotel. So this is about as far as I made it in the um, demo. Or the previous time I played. No Mickey Mouse. Let me go ahead and throw this in the chute. Okay, make sure there's no other trash in the room. Keep the room nice and tidy. Okay. Looks good. Looks good. I just saw Mickey Mouse in here. He's got trash in here. Well, guess what? It looks a little tacky, but guess what you get? You get a trap in the room. Got ya. Got you, Mickey Mouse. Down to shoot with you. Okay, uh, it's guys coming at four o'clock. And now we go down to floor one. What time is it? Oh, run the laundry. Run the laundry. I have to run twice. I put two rooms in there. I guess not. Okay. Wait for the gentleman. Ah, oh, we got to an hour and a half. Okay, there we go. Doo -doo -doo. That's a very Italian hat, sir. Uh, Fabio Montini. It's a very Italian name as well. Pick you up. Put you in here, Mr. Fabio Montini. Wait till until the gentleman leaves the room. 
Doom, 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 doom. Okay, upgrade anything here? No. Lobbies? No. There. For sure, the briefcase of the policeman. Wow, he was in there so long. I'm sure he had a wonderful sleep. Thank you, Mr. Montini. Have a wonderful day. You better not mess up the room. There better not be a dead body up in here or something. Okay, room's clean. No laundry, which is good. Back down to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby and get ourselves a treat. Let me skip some water here real quick. What was the Rakali snack? Uh, flavor packets in the water. There we go. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Officer. Inspector Vunok, here, your briefcase. Thanks, son. Uh, the whiskey was excellent. Here's a tip for your help. Well, thank you so much. Um, so you just pick one of three. He gave us 500 bucks. Uh, let's go to confirm. Uh, what's up with bed? There you go, confirm. We'll take this one. In Chicago, four factions are fighting for influence and power. The local police, who should be helping ordinary citizens, but don't always fulfill this duty. The Italian Mafia. Officially, they run restaurants on the main streets of the city. Unofficially, they conduct illegal businesses and eliminate those who try to interfere. The Russian gang. Poverty in their country brought them to America. They try to make a living in various ways. Damocles. Women who control prostitution throughout Chicago. Sex is a powerful weapon, and they are said to wield it masterfully. So this right here tells you that I'm right now 30% with the police, 15 with the Mafia, 10% with the Russian Mafia, and 5% with Damocles. Then over here I have $1,195. And this tells me how much I could pay to get things up. So I could actually spend $8 to get the police happier with me. That puts me up 1%. And get a little more for the Russians. Now, Damocles is very expensive. There, I'll grab that. Leave me $800, okay. My uncle used to say, business is best done over a good drink. Each of the four factions has its favorite alcohol. The police drink whiskey, the mafia drinks wine, the Russians drink vodka, and Damocles drinks gin. The bar will show me my level of trust with each faction. I can also buy alcohol to increase the trust level. Sometimes this may be necessary. If I stay close to the factions, I might find out who killed my uncle. One of them is certainly responsible for William Griffin's death. Just looking around the hotel. The motel, the hotel. Okay. Looks like nothing less left for the day, so... Good 8 a.m. Ding dong. Dong ding ding. Okay, it looks like we have events coming up here.
Yeah, if you're not sure what to do, you can hit the B and we'll give you like a little laser pointer. So we're almost up to something here. Looks like it's just three events today, no customers. Reception. That's your manager's office is a restaurant. Dressing room. Unlabeled. Laundromat. Run the laundry again, just to be on the safe side. Doesn't have anything in there, but. Eight. Eight. Six. Seven. Five. Three. Oh. Nine. Eight, six, seven, five, three, oh, nine. Guess not. Okay. I'll show repair the plumbing. Okay. Let's see. We get in here. I don't know which one it is. Yep, but. B. B. A. D. 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 Boom, there we go. 15 bucks. Okay, looks like we have another opportunity coming up here in a few minutes. I much prefer having guests coming in, but uh hundred and eighty bucks to open that room. And these other ones cheaper. Eighty bucks. 180, 180. Repair the electrics, okay. Not yours. Yours? No. Yours? No, where's the electrics? I'm not sure where the electric bear is, so. I'm not in that room yet. Let me go this way. Nope, okay. Ah, A D D D A. No, but I'm not getting this one. A D D D. Ah, oh, come on, we can get this. There you go, fifteen bucks. We'll make some money soon. Talk to a Damocles woman. Oh, okay. So here we have the um the red light district coming to pay a visit. 
Mm -hmm. Hello, beautiful. Hello, handsome. I need your help with a delicate matter. You look like a very brave man. I think you'll handle it wonderfully. Interesting. What is it about? I knew you'd agree. Today at 8 p.m., a man will come to your hotel. He'll ask for a room for one night. We're interested in his briefcase. Specifically, the documents inside it. Please, darling, steal those papers for me. I can see you're not lacking in courage and cunning. Of course, there will be a reward waiting for you once the task is done, sweetie. Sounds risky, but I should be able to handle it. Of course you'll handle it. The man will go to take a shower shortly after entering the room. They always do. You need to wait by the door until you hear the water. Then you'll be able to enter the room. Find the briefcase and open it. Here, this might come in handy. It's a lockpick set. Oh, picking his locks. Once you get the documents, bring them to me. I'll be waiting here at the bar. I recommend our gin. I think you'll definitely enjoy it. Oh, I'll definitely try it. Thank you, and see you later, darling. Okay. Place the desk in 101. I don't have a desk, do I? I didn't have a desk before. Did she give me one? Okay, let's see. Yeah, for a desk? I have a desk now, okay. Wait for the gentleman. Let's all go to the lobby. Have you ever heard that jingle before? I was like played a long, long time ago. I was a little kid going to the movies. They play that that little jingle in the movie theaters. Yeah, like uh, popcorn, soda, and all that marching towards the lobby, like a little um progression a little parade it's almost eight o'clock so we can wait thunk 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 he's coming in any second now so Doo, 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 doo. Hello, John. How you doing today? Oh, sorry, Giuseppe. Oh, he must be part of the mafia, huh? Pick him up. Put him in room one hundred one. Do 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 do. Do we feel to come back down because he can't ride up with them? Go up to our second floor. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's see. Okay.
Come on. Mm. Clipboard must be very important. Yeah, one thing I learned from ge uh, while I was geocaching is if you want to look um, to have everyone's attention when you try to find a geocache, is try to look like you know what you're doing and carry a clipboard. Miss Isabel, here are the documents. Fantastic, darling. Let me just check if everything is in order. Yes, everything is fine. Please take them to my friend. She's waiting by the entrance. I knew you could do it, sweetheart. Here's your reward. Call me if you ever need some company. Ooh. Ding dong. It's midnight. It's not midnight. It's still. Oh, yeah, it is midnight. Okay. Did he win me over the night? She made me a thousand dollars. I lost mafia reputation, but gained Damocles. Uh, nah, it's just patterns. I want some extra furniture. That's good. Um, the silence from the mafia is deafening. I've clearly crossed a line here, and they're not taking it lightly. How much should I make amends somehow? How much mafia reputation did I lose? That's the question. Oh, I'm at zero percent. Yeah, that's not good. Let's get a couple points in there. The twenty-five, thirty-one, twelve. Okay. The next event happens at eight o'clock. Get me to eight o'clock, please. Every Go to the newspaper. Newspapers will appear at the bar with a hidden request from one of the four factions. Some requests will be profitable for me. Others I may choose to reject. However, there may be requests that would be dangerous to leave unanswered. I need to manage my influence with each faction wisely. If any of the groups become dissatisfied with me, it could end very badly for me. Okay. Each international action, Italian businessman wants to meet and discuss important matters with investors and directors of Chicago's companies. It is set to be held at your hotel. So I gained five mafia and lose two and three percent of everything else. Post a meeting. Let's so see about getting that other room set up. I pay to get this one a lot more to get this one going, so I'll set that up. Okay. So we need a bed. You as far as over again. There. Okay. We have an extra bed. So many tables. If you have a couch, two of them. Put a couch right here. Okay. No music. No lights. Nothing here. You have a wardrobe over there, and I think we have a desk as well. We have a couple of desks. There. Let's 
to go upgrade the bathroom on this one. And this. Upgrade, yes. $65 room, nice. We have a little bit of stuff we can put in this other room over here too. Now we did not scrub the walls yet. Or repair the electrics. Okay, uh, where's the electrics that need repaired? Oh, okay. But this one, no, it's in the bathroom. Okay. A, D, D, A, D, D, A, A, D, D, A, D, 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 D. Boom. 15 bucks. Okay. Scrubber, scrubber, scrubber. Okay. Got a bed. Very big bed. Get from here. Uh, let's see. Go this way with the bed. Okay, I think we can get a desk in here, maybe. That's gonna be tight as hell. Anything else we can put in here? No chairs, no dressers, no tables. So we ask a lot. Yep, okay. Upgrade the bathroom and call this one done. Let's see the new guest. Okay, get you. Upgraded guest. Close. Yep, I'm on my way. I'm rushing, I'm rushing. Ding. Okay, no special thing with you. Put you in uh, this room. Have a good one. What's wrong with that room up there? Oh, he's still on the elevator. There's something wrong with that room? Forty-five, room one of four. Oh, 114, that's probably why I couldn't see it. Okay. Now the uh, Mafia person should be coming in soon. Ah, uh, they're on there. $45, okay. Serve the new guest. Hello, how you doing? Frida Merced, Morales. Hello, Frida. We'll get you in this room right here. It's a really strange thing. This whole big hotel is run by one guy. I have no idea how that even works. One person handling the entire hotel.
Anything over here? No. Nothing there. Okay. Oh, Russians are cheap today, so get the Russians up. Okay. 709. Get some Damocles. Leave the cops alone for now. Okay, nothing's going on. It's a waste of the morning. Talk to me after the guy. Buongiorno. I'm Lorenzo. I see the hotel is operational again. We've missed it a lot. Your uncle's hotel has fallen into good hands. I'm glad to hear that. How can I help you, Mr. Lorenzo? We'd like to organize a small event at your hotel. A poker night. However, we need the room to be set up in a specific way. That's not a problem, is it? We need a table, four chairs, a sofa, and a dresser. That shouldn't be a problem. Grazie mille. You are just as accommodating as your uncle. We'll be playing poker late into the night. Ah, one more very important thing. We don't want anyone disturbing us, Capisci? I understand. Molto bene. Here's half of the payment. You'll get the other half when I win. Ci vediamo. One or two, okay. Let's go up here and get these taken care of. Table, four chairs, wardrobe, cupboard, sofa. These cleaned up first. Should we get the stuff here? Okay. This is 102, correct? Yeah, 102, okay. So, we need a table. Four chairs. So far, a cupboard, table, four chairs, wardrobe, cupboard, sofa. Okay. Wait for Ranger's group to show up. Okay. Let's go down and do the laundry. All you need one to do, okay, good deal. They're all set up. It's only worth 55 bucks, but. Hmm. 
Let's go ahead and fast crime till we get here. Okay, first want to have a comedy show going. Let's scoot up to 8 p.m. Gentlemen. Gentlemen, uh, room or two is yours. Sorry, ladies. He said, don't disturb. Buongiorno. I heard some women tried to get into our room. Very good that you didn't let them in. Poker is not a game for broads. That was the deal. No disturbances. Grazie mille. Here's the second half of the payment. I won against them all. Ha <laughs> ha. Arrivederci. Okay. Let's see, it's a nice looking bed there. Cupboard. Ooh, first thing of that. Let's go get a nice looking bed. It's a pretty decent bed. We'll take that one. So, this has been my hotel. Um, set in the 50s. It's a nice little um, thing. I'm enjoying this game. I want to see more of it. So, I'm going to play more of it on this channel. Hopefully you like it too. If you do, drop a like. Leave a comment. If you really do like my content and want to come back, find your way back here in the future, go ahead and leave a comment. I'd be glad to help you out. Let's see you back here. So thank you for watching. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. And goodbye.